question three for library activity session one. For question three, you will be using Opposing Viewpoints database. This database is full of controversial topics and you will use it to answering the following questions. First one is about what the controversial topic is. Now this is not the main point or the main choice that you make. You must read a certain section as well as the same section for the next one. What is the author's stance? This one main specific section that I will point out to uh, will need to be read in order to answer these two questions. From the citation and other areas, you'll be able to answer the rest of the questions. When was the essay or article published? This is basically only the date, the title of the essay or article, and the author of who wrote this essay or article. Once you find your topic, you have it selected from browsing issues. You can then scroll down to review what kind of sources are available under this topic. The main one we want to focus on are the viewpoints that we have available here. Okay. Under these viewpoints, you may select any of the ones available. You can also do a search, but you want to make sure you focus it on viewpoint essays. You can see all of these are viewpoint essays here uh, in the part of the description here. So go ahead and choose one that matches uh, your area that interests you. Now, like I said, there are places for you to read and get all the information. The citation is one location. Here you can see the answers to the last three, the author, the title, and even the date. It even includes how it was originally published. So when it first came out in May 6 of 2019 under the publisher The Guardian, it was originally published under this title here. Okay, so what else do we have? Well, we have the title here as well. We have the author, the date, publisher, where it's located, and even to double check that it is a viewpoint essay and other information below. Now, for the first two questions, what is the controversial issue and what is the author's stance? You want to read this blue box section here. This blue box section will show you exactly what um, the main issue is. Uh, sometimes you can tell by the title, but you want to make sure you read this section to get a full understanding of what they're going to discuss, as well as it's going to help you figure out what is the author's stance, what is their viewpoint on this, were they for or against the controversial issue being discussed in this essay. If you need any assistance, do not hesitate to contact the library at the phone numbers on your screen or you can send us a question via libanswers.utep.edu.